stay out of the house. This video game is a genuine first generation copy produced on behalf of with the approval of Vague Scenarios LLC. There are violence and disturbing images in this game. Yeah, I can barely see anything. Oh, my eyes. Here was we playing Stay Out of the House. Press start. VHS is fine. They're gonna have CRT off though. <laughs> Better tell a difference in the resolution. <laughs> Other than the width of it. Frame cap, please, yeah. yeah. 64480 for realism? Yeah, don't, we don't have to have the effects then, do we? Night shift. You might not make it out alive, medium. Yeah, that's the highest I can do. Take the night shift, yeah? Want me to pick you up? Yeah. Yeah, it's too far to walk. <laughs> As if. I'll be conked out by then. I'll have a beer for you later. Have fun. Gas pump. Oh. Hey, man. Cats. Just in time. Hurry up and punch in. I've got a hot date tonight. I think I played this before. Did I just get scammed? This is a collection thing. Bullshit. <laughs> Bullshit. You wish. Come on, I've got to go. Did you sweep the floor at least? Sorry, dude. I was too busy. Hey, Rick left a list of side work to do on your shift. Now I've got to get out of here. Oh yeah, one more thing. I can't find the keys anywhere. The bathrooms are locked up. So go behind the dumpster, I guess. Lovely. Lovely. Hey, I'm just trying to be pragmatic. You should try it sometime. Have you ever worked in a place like this, chat? It would be kind of nice until drunk people come. Eros. Didn't I play this? Yeah, I did play this. I'm gonna rage quit it. Fuck, I thought it was a new game. I got scammed. Prologue, the house, the bunker. 
You know what? I might play it again, but without these fucking effects for once. It seems like it's part of the prologue anyway. New game. Yeah. yeah, get out of the house. Doesn't exist. Okay, game plus demos. Six? Uh, yeah. Want me to pick you up? No, I'll get a ride. No, I'll get a ride. Perfect. I was just asking to be nice. I'll have a beer for you later. Have fun. Bye. I always wanted to be lesbian. Not driving, yeah. I got this car here. Wow, look at this fucking vehicle. Hey dude, you got a hot date? Just in time. Hurry up and punch in. I've got a hot date tonight. Oh. With who? Wouldn't you like to know? Come on, I've got to go. Is the phone fixed? Is the phone fixed? No, the telephone company never came. It's still dead. You shouldn't be making phone calls at work anyways. <laughs> hey, Rick left Alyssa's side work to do on your shift. Now I've got to get out of here. Oh yeah, one more thing. I can't find the keys anywhere. The bathroom's unlocked up. So, go behind the dumpster, I guess. Have a good date. Have a good date. If my calculations are correct, I'll be rounding third base of one hour and 16.32 seconds. Good luck, dude. God damn it, there's a camera there. It's gonna fucking look at me when I like the bean or whatever women do. Water oil. There we go, perfect. Oops. Looks like ships like that right there, huh? Just some candy. Where do you store the ships in these places? Oh, right there, okay. Good old American beer. Do you think women masturbate at work? Probably. Nothing wrong with that. Hey guys, sorry if the phone isn't fixed. You'll have to be uh, to de be with me until the help repair guy comes. Don't worry, I'm not expecting any emergencies. I need the guys to do a better job for a yeah, better job on the side work during your shift. I'm ex expecting this to be finished when I come. In the afternoon. One, sweep the floor. Two, place items in the weren't purchase back where they belong. Clean the bathrooms, Rick. <laughs> Noise should be in here. Boom, 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 boom. Shot that explodes. Oh no! How could it happen? Don't leave a story. Yeah, but I'm trying to look for the swipe. Broom swipe.
sweep. Sweep the toilet. Oh, what, 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 what do they just do? They just break it? Clean the bathroom. Oh. Oh shit. There's a customer coming. Nice weather we having. <sighs> hey, dude. Hi, can you give me ten dollars on pump five? Thanks. I'll take for the money. You can't leave the store, you need to clean the toilets outside. I would really massacre. Why is the toilet on the outside of these places normally, anyway? No hot dogs? I'm not making more. Why not? What if someone asks for hot dogs? Quit smoking, pussy. Something interesting. Maybe I'll heat up something later. Let's make something first. Wait, I can actually make food? Oh, god damn it! Too sweet! Any hot dogs in the fridge? The fridge? Soda. Maybe I'll have some later. Could you drink free soda if you work in a store like this? You get free soda, like, and you can drink whenever you want. Of course they would do that, right? That should be fine. Oh shit, there's a car here. Can you find gas stations like this in the middle of nowhere? In America? The motherfucker didn't even fucking flintstone by silently, yeah. Cool, so these places exist. I better be sweeping again then.
This would never happen, you know, she would never be unsafe here if she had a gun. And learn how to quick draw. And if it seems like a nice guy robbing her, always shoot him in the back when they leave instead. Where are you headed? Where are you headed? Uh, east. I didn't realize those split cameras over here before I stopped. Uh, anyways, can I have a pack of Banshee red filters? Banshee red filters, right here. Thanks. Oh, hey. Can I use the bathroom? Yeah, this is kind of weird. Where the fuck did you put the keys, bitch? You can jump up here and just hide from the murderer. You might not be able to get me up in the corner here. <laughs> My boss comes in and I'm fucking sitting here in the corner. Hello. Didn't you also play a Japanese gas station game? Yeah, that was awesome. Oh, thank you. Is it the same van again? I hear some older music playing from it as well. Get, grab a fistful of gummy balls and throw at it. How long could you survive on eating a corpse of a human being? If it's like an average, like a, a 80 kilogram person. Would you last for an, an, at least a year, right, with meat? Half a year? Yeah, frozen and refrigerated. I'm just asking because perhaps someone has experience. Shall it explodes? Tragic. Didn't the, like, wasn't there a teacher on the rocket the, 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 it as well? And the entire class was watching as it exploded.
Kinda fucked up. Sucks for those kids. Yeah, fucking record my cleavage. Squeeze it together. Mm. It keeps seeing me. I, I keep seeing a Japanese horror girl in that corner. You were one of those kids, you just sat there and did some uh, prediction, Twitch predictions. Will it explode? Like we have done here a few times. What the fuck a Japanese horror girl? Yeah, they're usually a bit petite, you know. As long as they're over, you know, but they're probably like hundreds of years old, aren't they? This can't just be waiting. I have to do something too, right? Or it's warping because it's a PlayStation. PlayStation graphics were much worse compared to Nintendo 64 graphics. I've been clicking. It hasn't worked so far. It's something specific I need to look for. Here we fucking go, now I can hear them. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh no! It's Bob Ross! Hi. You here all alone? Fuck, we got a deep voice, that's boss now. Hang on. Yes. Yes. Hello. Wanna rotate on my cock? It's me getting monster and sausages, yeah. I wouldn't grab those donuts, I've been there all day. Yeah, I'm just warning you. Do you think people come into stores and act all suspicious like this just to have some fucking... to feel powerful or some stupid shit? You do it just for the loves. Gonna drink some coke.
What a weird motherfucker. Take cover. Corner. No one can catch me here. I can make it up here. Oh, that's perfect. I gotta hide on top of the donuts. You can make it over there. Oh. I might be safe in the center of the store. Let's be. A role playing woman. Hang on, why can't I why can't I get up there anymore? Oh god. Can't get me up here, can you? Bitch. Floor is lava. Floor is lava. Yeah. It's... Oh, uh, fuck. I need to clean the toilet, do I?
see anything. I go blind. Ugh. I'll spend So the thing we played was a prologue, prologue. Broken, broken, empty. Brendan! I'll spend? What the fuck? What do women get so much privacy? Brandon! Brandon! I grab a snack then for now. I'm out of here. Oh, I can actually get out of here. Good. Lillard. Brandon. Rest for a wicked on running back home, I can never mind. Let's go, Brandon. I think a woman can pee in these as well. They like get really close to the wall. If you woke up like this, let's say I'm your husband, and if we drove into a rest stop like this in America, and I'm like, oh, I was gonna take a pee, and then I'm disappeared, what do you think I would have done? Get a new husband. Call Ghostbusters. 
Just call the police with your cell phone. But it's out. The cell phone is out. You're all alone here. <laughs> it's American, uh, you know. It's there's, um, there's no coverage. Not even GSM. Yeah, but I have the keys. Well, there actually is a path here. But you can't get behind the house with it. Lillard. Just sleep in the truck until someone else comes up. Yeah, hiding in the back of the truck would be a smart thing, but you wouldn't know there was a murderer on the loose. Am I actually blind? What? There may be some blood or something in here. Oh shit. My god, Brandon A. Wright. 510? Oh my god. Tiny. <laughs> I guess he's tall in America. Oh, come with me. Up here. At the beginning of this upcoming month, all work and production conducted at Crawl Ford Mill will cease to continue. The lack of business over the past year, the owners unfortunately cannot afford to keep the mill open. And running there for it would be condemned and sold to the state, where they will either repurpose the building or demolish it. Furthermore, the owner of the establishment has been diagnosed with stomach cancer, likely due to radiation exposure. Himself and his wife will be moving away from Shatterville in hopes of finding a better treatment center close to the city. He sends his deepest apologies to all employees who they dedicated their time and effort towards the betterment of the company. You, you may gather all your belongings within the last week of production. Otherwise, we will be it will be thrown out of the building as the building gets cleaned before the condemned. In condemned. Thank you all. Boy. They left you behind? Were you condemned as well? Oh no! But he's innocent. Brendan! Do you think this is gonna end, end with us finding Brendan? And we tank a dog. Oh my god, look at the dog! And we leave to get our teddy bear. Is this yours? Shall I drop this?
Mis glasses. It's a short share. Was someone dropped their valuable luggage? That's a good question. Children of the corn. Why are you coming? Oh my god, is Maces called Maces because of Mace? Boy, go. This is where you lived. Good boy. I did. Wait, what happened here? California. Nothing of value lost. Our mission. The goal of the Church of Father's Vision is to create a community abundant with repentance and salvation. We will help you obtain a growing relationship with thyself and the Lord, either at one of our many days of worship in person or via weekly tapes, which can be delivered to your doorstep. We seek to spread the message of God across thy world to provide thy unknowing ignorant or those in need thy everlasting life he has waiting for us all. Dr. James F. Biao is an authentic server of server of ser, server of God. His early childhood, um, childhood, a married man, father, and beloved pastor, he firmly believes in living by Christ through spreading his gospel and encouraging his neighbors to worship the Lord with him, him at the church of Father's wisdom. God in his goodness has called on me to, to preach the world. My desire is to please and glorify him with my life. And I hope to join hands with the world and live by his words through worshipping him as one. <coughs> Dr. Bow and his wife, uh, Margaret Bow, hold service at the Church of Father's Vision each Sunday morning at 11.15. Located at 69-6, Lane, Georgetown, uh, K Connecticut, KY, 4032 for, for VHS tapes and more call, 57-5090, Kentucky, Kentucky, Kentucky. Choose your father's wisdom, let us guide you towards righteousness. What's the dog sniffing for? Good boy. What are you looking for? Boy. 
Something bad's gonna happen now when I leave, right? Oh fuck, there you are, boy. Alright, come with me. We're gonna go back this way. Turn here. Okay, no, no, that end. Oh fuck, are we just gonna get back to the truck now, perhaps? Yeah, we're fuck. God damn it. Let's go find Jesus in the house of the Lord. Shall we, little one? Come on. And thou, God, said, Purge them marvelous and normous from the world. They shall eat the meat of the... 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 It's called... What was it called? Landland. The landlord. But we shall protect thy flesh. The rent cucks must be perish. Amen. To all members of the Cedarville Assembly of God, this letter is to inform all petitioners at the Cedarville Assembly of God of some unfortunate, sudden, and upcoming changes to our standard curriculum. Being said, with a heavy heart, our family of religious followers have turned elsewhere. There are few who still attend our service, while the rest have sought out an opposing teaching nearby. However, the sanctuaries they found stray further from the Bible and from our God than originally thought. In fact, they are not following the Bible, and it's my understanding that their symbolus is full of nonsensical gibberish. I don't know who or what they are worshipping, but friends and colleagues of mine have started to treat me as a stranger, as if they cannot converse with me due to their new beliefs. I've dealt with the threatening letters over the past few weeks, as well as an attempt at arson on our beloved church. Last night while eating with my family, a bullet was fired through my kitchen window. While it barely missed my head, it had completely obliterated one of my favorite paintings given to me by one of our core members. This treatment and threats are things I cannot take lightly, and therefore, after collecting my belongings at the church, I will be leaving town in search of a new place to worship. I do not wish to leave, but I feel like I have no choice. I advise anyone who still comes to our church to join me towards a new place of hope and prosperity. Thank you for all your kindness and understanding for this, during this time. Okay. Dog? Hey! Boy! Never put a fucking shirt next to a cornfield like this. Yes, they would really. Wait, I hope I'm not blind and missed something over here. Is there a corn dog behind me? <laughs> Come on. 
Corn for Conholio, he needed shipping for his bunghole. Well, well, let's go back to the car. I bet Brendan is just waiting for me. Private property, no trespassing. Look at that fucking scarecrow over there. Go trespass, let's go. <laughs> yeah, but that can possibly happen in a cornfield, you know? That's true. Oh god. Scary. And Bubla. Oh, don't be underneath that. Oh my god, what are you doing? Combine harvester. You think that this dog came with the hippies? Did you, boy? Sad seeing a homeless person panhandling with their dog. Yeah, but it makes sense though, wouldn't it? Sympathy. Fallout shelter. What's wrong? Fine. Right. Boy. We sad.
hell? Is that a human hand up there? Radiation, that's kind of fucking weird, though. Okay, there we go. The hell? Bike made from bones? No, that's fucking metal. Oh, shelter. Don't worry. I'll get you out of there. Free friend. Oi, where do you go? You run upstairs this time? <laughs> oh fuck! Stomach. What did it do to me? There was a world that we envisioned for ourselves. Perhaps a perfect idea of a utopia where we all live in our love and peace. Make no mistake, that is all part of the plan that is set before us. And we all have the tools we need to get there. We simply need some guidance to utilize those tools correctly. That's why you're here, with us. You simply need to seize that happiness, the one that's already been set before you, and help us create that perfect world. That world of shape and reason, and a divine understanding. Throughout our series on tape, we'll be helping you see the vision of perfection. <laughs> Did I just kill myself?
Oh! Oh, hi, dude. Is it a bad ending watching the TV? I think I restarted the entire game. I mean, I can pick shit up here. I was supposed to die down and go to the bunker part of the game. Oh, open, here we go. Nothing. What noise are you annoying about? Look up. Fuck you, there's no up, anything up. Oh, oh shit. Oh, fuck. Night shift of Doctor Strikes again. Will Creek. Will Creek, okay. The gruesome realization of the encamp. The gruesome realization of the incompetence of our once trusted police force shines its head once again after the sixth in what now can be considered an undeniably connected series of in kidnappings from the late night shops and 24-hour restaurants across a large portion of western Oklahoma. When is Halloween... When is, when is the Halloween night? Where people go out and trick-and-treating? As of last night, 34-year-old Deborah Kops, Kops, Kopsky 
Uh, it's the latest victim of the notorious night shift abductor that has a considerable presence in our terrify in terrifying our communities over the last four weeks. Though initially thought to be unrelated disappearances, three locations show video evidence of the same abductor at multiple locations between Center County and its surrounding areas. All six abductions have had very similar circumstances. Uh, typ typically, the employee was alone on the shift in the dead of night and was confronted by the assailant after a period of observation. When the venue was at a period of little to no business, the victims were assaulted via blunt objects before rendered immobile or unconscious and being removed from the store into what they can only assume to be an unmarked vehicle. Though only three moments Three moments of video evidence has been provided. The police can and state investigators finally conceded that this string of kidnappings is likely performed by the same assailant. The night shift abductor is the is the as the moniker has been provided a lo a large built adult man assumed to be in his mid to late thirties, standing roughly six four. Oh, it's me, and I'm assumed two hundred fifty pounds. Okay, never mind. Very few other details of the assailant's unknown, as his identity is well concealed during the assaults via a makeup burlap mask and a thick seasonal clothing. And the def definably all features that the kidnapper also has noticed as wearing a heavy rubber apron at the scenes of the la least three of the six apparent kidnappings. A police sketch of the a police sketch artist has made a rough look at the assailant's appearance and are making anyone in the public who see this man report whereabouts immediately to local offices. Police and public schools should be on lookout for anyone matching this notably odd appearance during any late night outings they may be on, as the habits and patterns of the abductor's crimes are not fully identified. But make no mistake, these incidents do not appear do not the the incidents do not appear rot be slowing down appear to be slowing down how much longer are we ex to expect this slow unproductive case to continue with so little evidence to be shown after such a rash and violent attacks have been continuing it brings light to uh, okay Oh, a shit share. Thank you, valid customer, for your purchase. Your brand new lock has been pres and preset code which cannot be changed. We would advise you to store this paper so you always have your combination. This is probably for Fallout Shelter. Wait, can I figure out the Fallout Shelter code in the first part of this game? Eh, uh, do I have any fucking... Where's my notebook? Notebook. There you are. Wait, is this a brand new notebook? Yeah, this is a brand new one. Cool. Use the paper clip, you stupid bitch. Drop item V. IGUI. Take picture, command. Flashlight toggle. Reload gun. Oh, gun? I 
inventory set. Okay, thank you. Paperclip. Oh, I thought that the paperclip was gonna be what I used to unlock shit with. Oh. Well. Oh my god, I can open this door. Trip wire over there. Oh my god. This is definitely my basement. Nine o'clock. I hear movement. Red line, wait, did I fuck it up? Am I stupid or something sometimes? Okay, what do I need a screwdriver for? Spent cover. Oh wow.
¿Quién qué? Several severed the body parts. I got a little rat friend down there. Yummy, yummy! I get to eat all the fucking leftovers I want. Mm, nom, 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 nom. Come full circle there then, okay. Feels like I've been locked in this house for weeks, but it's only been a few days. I'm losing track of time. I heard v uh, a whirling, a whirling coming from under the house. What is he doing down there? I can't think about that. There were tunnels down there. Looked like they were... they went on forever. I tried to escape but they caught me... came up with me with a damned... The damned radar. He locked me back upstairs but I saw where he kept the radar. He locked it in the closet. The combination was 52 is 91. I can't forget that number. thing off Lighter would be boiling. You can't have those turn on for too long or something.
They just having a good time here, except for, you know, the people they killed, I guess. I will take a piss, you stay in the in the closet chat, is that okay? there? I don't know. That's ridiculous. The... Oh, without Wi-Fi. Oh. This Wi-Fi has no in access to the internet. Oh, she's driving around now. Holy shit. But we're on the internet, aren't we? Are you guys on the internet? This thing has the internet. I mean, I wouldn't be able to stream without the internet. Internet? What the hell?
Thank God, there we go. Imagine losing internet on your phone so you can't run your own fucking light bulbs. Fuck's sake. Yummy, 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 look at all the goop! Yeah, it's so happy. The rat is the happiest thing ever. He's so happy. Dude, they would love to eat some human flesh, wouldn't they? It's probably great. Was it a, was it inside of the goop or was it a, like a worm or something? Wait, does the guy counter warn if the dude is closer or further away? No. Oh my god, I'm gonna come and test some of this. Oh lord, I can't open it. That's probably where we store this freezer. The GM counter is super high now. Be on the other side of this wall. See outside that. The being so toxic, chat.
way down to turn the gas off. My fucking god. Are you kidding me? Fuck this game is cool though. It's stressing me the fuck out though. going down.
the wire with something over here. I think I need a stone. I don't think so myself. Titanium doorknob. What I should do is wait for the old lady to come down again. I'm gonna hide in here, let her pass me by. And then... Uh, this fucking bike though, look at it. That's kind of metal, isn't it? We need to find something to screw in up here as well. What do we have? Human hand... That door is the coded one? Yeah, but we already used the code for another door. <laughs> Albert Porkins, I meant ride her over with the bike. Sex based term. Held for reason. <laughs> How dare you post naughty shit like that in chat, Porkins. You son of a bitch. Ride her? Time to get banned. And not just on Twitch. This is like the granny game. Oh, now we're here, okay. Oh god. He's not gonna knock the door open as well, really. Walk on the trap line or whatever.
Ah, fuck. Oh, great. Oh, no. Whoops, Stacy. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, fuck! Oops, well, that's not good. <laughs> Oops. Brothers and sisters, children of faith. You have a good thing. Thank you. Anger can be overwhelming for many. And this is a truly human state to find yourself in. However, anger doesn't have to be something that you lose yourself to. Like all things we experience in the imperfect world, it can be a tool. I'll show you how to utilize this powerful tool. I'll shape it into something productive. Something that can both strengthen you and your faith. Perhaps you can even use it to... Wait, what's like? And show them misguided the perfection that they hope to attain. It's up to you to show the world its imperfections. Only through that. I was, like, I was about to say, to wait, did they add a camera down here? Yep. Brothers and sisters, children of faith, do you ever feel angry? Now, anger can be overwhelming for many, and this is a truly human state to find yourself in. However, anger doesn't have to be something that you lose yourself to. Let's find out what's on the upstairs. How do I use fucking paper clips? One bullet. Ah. Doggo is most likely a very nice sandwich somewhere. Alright, the hammer. What's the hammer for, you think? I think I can just sneak up on that old lady and just bash her head in. Small hole in vent, perhaps. That's true. Let's try to hammer an innocent little rat. It's not in here anymore.
Are you sleeping down here, rat? I'm so full of human meat! Oh my god! Oh, I'm fucking bursting! Oh. There's a swole rat, definitely. Perfect full speed. But yeah, the fucking we have to jump over that next time. He can't find me in here, can he? Just kill me then, bitch! <sighs> Sacrified. Let me see what it looks like. Oh, it's just this thing again. Oh, suck your dick! Please, no! Ah, my ears! Ah! Pretty cool game. You could try it again at some time. Oh my god, I got my ears! Holy shit, they can't do this to people. It's illegal.